I didn't expect to find this in sand caves on Daymar. I was unprepared, but good thing is that persistence worked this time. Hello citizens, for today's video I want to visit the sand caves of Daymar for the first time since they exist in the game. So I took my trusty herald and started my journey to unknown. If you want to know how to find sand caves in Daymar, I have a video which will explain how to find sand caves super easy. Just look at your top right corner right about now. Ok, so upon my arrival I parked my ship near the cave entrance. I turned off the ship's engines and transferred all power to shields. I've entered the cave and start to explore. I urge you to start visiting sand caves, because very soon we will have a very rare mineable mineral worth a lot of money, so you better prepare for things that are coming. I found a small life form called Stonebug. I love how the lights enters the cave, it looks really awesome. Another stone bug. I must say they did a really good job uh, with this new sand case. Atmosphere is awesome. This really looks amazing. The shadows, the lightning, everything looks really nice. Anyone knows how many of these caves we have here on Daymar? This rock formation looks really good. Here I'm trying to see, is there any way to go down, because I'm not sure how deep this is. It seems like this is the way to go down. And then I saw this. At first I was not sure what am I looking at. In the cave's entrance there was no ship outside, so I am not sure is this live player or uh, just an NPC. Now I am even more interested to find a way uh, down there and try to loot this guy. At this point I am aware how unprepared I have come to this cave. If I had the hand tool with the tractor beam, I could easily pull this guy up and, of course, loot him. So, that's my first mistake. And now I'm thinking, you know, is there a mission? Like, you know, a lost NPC that you need to find in this cave? I just wanted to be sure, so I wanted to find a way down to him at all costs. I was trying to get as low as possible. Another stone bug. Hello, little friend. It seems there is a lot of these guys here. At this point, I have decided to jump down since Daymar has low gravity, so I thought that. Mistake number two. So, I died and woke up in Area 18 Hospital. I was on my way back to Daymar Cave, where I just died, but this time 
with all the gear I need to pull that guy up. And then my phone ringed and I answered. I was on my phone for about 15 minutes and game kicks me out for inactivity. Well, I logged back and again set my course to Daymar Sand Caves. On my approach, I spotted a ship on my radar, parked near the cave. It was Drake Herald. Hmm. That was my ship from previous game session. It seems I got the same server shard after I was kicked out of the game. So I've landed, entered the cave and saw that I'm not recording, of course. So I press record button and uh, here I am. Back to see is uh, that that guy is still there. This time I will take this stone bug because I have the backpack and I got an idea for another video. Okay, now let's see is the dead guy still here? Let's test if this persistence really works. Yep, it works. The guy is still here. I'm still not sure if this is an NPC or a real dead player. Let's find out. Okay, this is a good place. I will now try to pull this guy up. Okay, this is definitely a live player because of the helmet. I think this is the Caudillo or Caudillo helmet. One of my favorite and I like to wear the white ghost version. If this is the same, that means this helmet is pledged, so I'm pretty sure this is this was the live player. Okay, let's see what you have. Definitely not an NPC. Okay, I will definitely take this helmet. Now what is this? Is this a box? Yep, it's a box. What happened here? Let's open it up. Hmm, empty. Okay. Okay, there is definitely more than one guy down there. And another life player. What? Okay, let's loot you up. Nice, we have some gems too. Yes, let's take this and sell it. So after these two dead guys, I was trying to locate my own dead body uh, so that I can loot my armor back and I guess I, I discovered the third person. 
it seems that uh, for now it, it, it is like three dead guys here. What the hell happened here? Okay, let's pull you up. So I'm still trying to find my own dead body. Guy. What is this? I would really love to know what happened here. Okay, let's see what you have. You know, this is why I love Star Citizen. You never know what, what, what awaits you, you know. And I just wanted to see a sand cave. I certainly didn't expect this. So, after I spent some time in searching for my own stuff and armor, I decided that I had enough of adventures for today, so I went towards cave exit, back to my ship. Here you can see my first ship from previous game session, and for some reason I could not get in anymore, I don't know why. As a conclusion, my advice to you is that you always equip yourself properly, because you never know what awaits you in the verse. Multitool with tractor beam is a must-have, and you can add mining and salvage attachments too. Med pens, food, drink, even the gun. Some extra light, big backpack, because you never know what you can find. As you can see, this is a very nice chance to, to find some uh, special items uh, like uh, pledged armor or helmet stuff that you can find in uh, lootable boxes or in game at least for now stay safe in the verse and may the force be with you